guys. Okay, so I'm back to finish up here my local scrapbook store haul. And I picked up the Doodle Bug Essentials October 31st collection. And um, you get five 12 by 12 double-sided cardstock. You get some sticker sheets. Um, so here it is here. Here's the front. And so these are really, really cute stickers. I mean, just adorable. Again, I love the vibrant colors. Really, really fun. And they didn't have, the reason I got this was because they didn't have any of this um, singly sold. So I had to get the whole kit, which was fine. And I love those mini doodle pops with the spiders. You get the sequins, which I probably wouldn't have got because I have a lot of sequins. Sorry for the glare, but those are fun. And then the ribbon there. So, and then you get, um, looks like some ABCs and numbers there. And then on the back, it shows you, so <clears throat> what you get is the pop-ups, the sequins, the ribbon, and then you get, oh, it looks like you get borders, your alphas, and then your other. So you get three 6x12 cardstock sticker sheets, and then you get the cut-aparts, and then you get those cardstocks. So really fun. Um, and then I picked up some of the doodle pops that they that they did have there and this little Frankenstein or whatever is so stinking cute and I love the moon and the star and the little mouse so adorable and then the little ghost super adorable I love his little purple tie and then I did get the owls and they had these for the fall but um, the Halloween ones are super super cute and then I picked up just some single. Again, they didn't have a lot, so I'll quickly show you some of the 12 by 12 sheets. So I picked up this one with the pumpkins, which is so cute. And the green with white polka dots. The candy corn, which my granddaughter loves her candy corn, so that was a must. And um, I think they had this pattern in their last year's Halloween. I love it, love it. I was glad to see it again. And then I love these little skulls with all the, the colorful eyes. It really just brightened it. And um, here is just your little squares there, kind of a graph sort of kind of. And here's green on green polka dots. And then here's just really colorful, vibrant polka dots, which I absolutely love. And then this is my favorite. Well, there's two. This one and the next one were my favorites. But I'm really bummed that they didn't have more because I definitely would have gotten more than one sheet. I love those owls. And then, again, it's it looks really light on camera, but it's more of a, a medium, like a nice teal color with the stars, which I love the stars for Halloween. And then here are these stinking cute ghosts with the colorful stars in between. And I absolutely love them. It's so cute. And then here's the diagonal stripes, which matches the ribbon that came with the collection. So that was fun. And then a couple of random. This is Crate Paper After Dark. And these are the puffy stickers. You get 37 of them. And I just thought that they were so cute. I had to get them. Really, really adorable. And then <clears throat> this is the Cartabella Trick or Treat by Stephen Duncan. And these are the element stickers. And I absolutely love these. And I love the vintage-ness, if that's a word, and I absolutely just love them. There's the candy corn. I love the little witch with her candy apples. Um, I love the two with their masks, the pumpkin head and the witch. Um, just absolutely love, love, love it. So really, really fun. And then I also picked up... <coughs> um, three things from the Simple Stories Claws and Company or Claws and Co. And these are the, let's see, chipboard frames. You get 24 pieces. And I love these little frames. They're so much fun. And um, yeah, I think you get all different sizes and 
and patterns. So I think that's going to be a lot of fun. I have a couple ideas for those. And I got the new brads, which I absolutely love. And you get, it looks like 13 of them. And these are the self-adhesive without the prongs. And um, I love that Santa. The, I love them all. They're all so cute. So that's going to be really fun to incorporate into any project. And then I picked up the... Um, <clears throat> the um enamel dots and you get 60 of them and only that darker red on the left is glittery and they're just all really really nice so i'm looking forward to using them as well so that is it for my local scrapbook store i just also wanted to share that i ended up picking up four of the um from Tuesday morning of the Merry and Bright by Pink Paisley i ended up picking up four i think I can't remember if I picked up one or two on my original haul and um, when I, I had been checking back and I ended up finding, finding more and I absolutely love this paper. So thrilled to have four of them so I'm going to definitely be using those with cards. And then I ended up with two of the, um, the Studio Calico, the Magical Collection, which I absolutely love this one as well. So really fun. Um, the peppermints, I love the pink in that. And I've already got some images colored up to use with this paper for cards. So that's been really fun. I also picked up this last week when I had um, an, a mailer from Joann's with the 50% off. And so I used it on this Project Life from Becky Higgins from Michael's, the Photo Sleeve Fuse. And I'm really excited to use it. It I did my little bit of research and it looks like it's exactly the same <clears throat> as the We Are Memory Keepers one. It's just a different color. It appears that it comes with everything just the same. So I cannot wait to get started with this. And um, Nurse Tara 04. Hi Tara. She is just such an inspiration. And I love those little shaker pocket or shaker gift card holders um that she was showing on her channel and i'm sure you're all subscribers to her because she's amazing but if for some reason you're new to youtube and you're not familiar with her please go check her out so i'm really excited to um get this video done so i can cut that open and get going on it i also picked up um these pine cones by ashland um they smell so good they remind me of cookies Christmas cookies like when I was young that my mom used to make and, and they smell so good. So they were $4.99. They had them half off last week and then I had the extra 25% off. So I don't know what that comes out to, but it was so stinking cheap that I picked one up. I probably should have picked up two and I'm going to use them while they smell because the lady and Michael said they really don't smell that long. And then I'm going to use them for some kids crafts with Addison when they're done. So, um, that is that for now. So I hope you guys are all having an awesome day. Thank you so much for stopping by and we'll talk to you soon. Love ya. Bye.